This is example 13. Find the inverse Laplace transform of 7s minus 6 over s plus 2 s minus 3. We are going to find this inverse Laplace transform by the method of partial fractions. First, we notice that 7s minus 6 over s plus 2 s minus 3 can be written as a number a over s plus 2 plus a number b over s minus 3. We are going to find the values of a and b. What you can do is multiply both sides by s plus 2 s minus 3. Then you get 7s minus 6 equal to a times s minus 3 plus b times s plus 2. In order to find a, this is very easy. You just put s equal to negative 2. Then you have left hand side is 7 times negative 2 minus 6 equal to a times negative 2 minus 3 plus 0. And then you get minus 20 equal to minus 5a. So a equal to 4. To find b, you put s equal to 3. Then the left hand side you have 7 times 3 minus 6 equal to 0 plus b times 5 since 3 plus 2 is 5. That means that 21 minus 6 is 15 equal to 5b or b equal to 3. So we have 7s minus 6 over s plus 2 s minus 3 is equal to a is 4 over s plus 2 and b is 3 over s minus 3. So inverse Laplace transform of 7s minus 6 over s plus 2 s minus 3 is the same as the inverse Laplace transform of 4 over s plus 2 plus 3 over s minus 3. This is equal to inverse Laplace transform of 4 over s plus 2 plus inverse Laplace transform of 3 over s minus 3. Factor out the constant factor. This is 4 times the inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s plus 2 plus 3 over inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s minus 3. Now, we recall that inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s minus a is e power a t as Laplace transform of e power a t 
is equal to 1 over s minus a. So, the answer for this inverse Laplace transform problem is equal to 4 times e power negative 2t plus 3 times e power 3t.